what's up guys, the Duck Opinion here, and uh, yeah, last episode we kind of got our ass kicked by a dragon, but not really. I took that dragon, I handled his ass, and he just got a last hit on me and killed me. But we came back, we kind of did it stealthy, was careful, turned into a vampire, didn't work out well, went back to our farm, whipped his ass. So now we're back, doing part 6 of our DLC for Skyrim Dragonborn. So let's go in here and see what the hell's going on. Yes. And if you guys haven't noticed, this game is extremely laggy on Xbox. Like, it is kind of ridiculous how laggy it is on Xbox. I feel like I'm playing it on, like, a laptop or something. I guess if I was playing it on a laptop, it wouldn't run at all. But, still, shit's pretty laggy, and it's kind of weak, because you can tell that they're really pushing this. They're really pushing the limits. So, hey, we start off uh, with a new shout. What might it be? <coughs> is it part two of the other one? Earth Ben Will? Earth Ben Will. Hmm. Hmm. There it is. I like how it's black. You can tell what it is. Your voice blends the very stone to your will. It's a gain power. As it gains powers, animals, people, and even dragons must do your bidding. Now that sounds like the shout that makes it where you can ride a dragon. It says you can, you can, you, it, they must do your bidding. I don't know if that's the one, but we'll definitely unlock it because we have 21 souls and now we have 20. Not sure exactly. I don't think that's the one to ride the dragon because I still think they're just going to give that to us at the end of the DLC. Why would they give us the best thing first? You know what I mean? Let me grab that. Hey, girl. Can you wear something besides you that hood? Something? I would like you to have something. Anything good? Yes, I would like you to have this. Even if you don't wear it, you should probably take it anywhere. Yours. Wait. No. You take that. And I put on my helmet. Like, I understand the equip. Equip. Oh no, I just ended up taking all that shit, didn't I? Oh, I'm such a noob when it comes to this. Give her that. You can have your boots back. You can have... I don't know. Did I give you all your stuff back? Your boots? You had, um... You had some gloves, lady. There they are. Give you those back, too. Okay, I'm sorry I took your stuff. I think you need to learn how to take off your helmet... And let me put the thing on top of your head and like better armor because you just don't listen to me half the damn time. When I tell you to do something, you're like, no, I'm just going to not wear that. And I'm like, bitch, you're supposed to be wearing what I say. But to each their own. So where the hell is this entrance? They're acting like I missed it. Well, you know, whenever you're confused, that's why we, get the, that's why we have this clear avoidance spell. Oh, that fucked my life. <laughs> No, this way. Okay. Actually, I don't trust this thing. This thing has took me to some places before. Is that dragon I kicked his ass? I can't believe that dude showed up and was like, By the way, I'm taking this dragon soul. And I look at him like, dude, I have like 20 of them saved up, so you're not a boss whatsoever. And then he's like, oh. And he just like leaves. <laughs> Man. They need another patch because... I don't know if you guys noticed in the last episode, but a lot of the stuff I did, it didn't quite... Hold on, let me make sure that I'm not being dumb here. Use bend the wheel shout on the windstorm. Oh, okay, so I was supposed to come here and learn that shout. Okay. I mean, I thought, I thought, I mean, I knew I was supposed to come here and learn that shout, but I thought I'd have to go in like a, you know into something. I thought I'd have to like go into like a castle or not a castle but you know just um like whatever the hell they call those things like a dungeon or something you know to go find it. And it was just I had to fight that dragon so I guess the whole point of that whoa big ass drop I guess the whole point of that was to pretty much you know fight a dragon and be like hey I apparently can't kill this guy 
is, is I guess it was pretty much to establish that that other Dragonborn's pretty much a badass and come steal my shouts like a D-bag. I guess they're pretty much just establishing that in this episode. Look at us trailing mountains and shit. <coughs> Honestly though, man, all this snow and stuff, I really felt like they should have kept it out. Like, Skyrim is full of snowy patch crap. And I come back tomorrow and I'm like, I don't want to play a snowy patch crap that looks just like Skyrim. I wanted to look just like Morrowind, and it did have that feel. For like the first, you know, the first place you went to, it had that feel. But now this just feels like I'm in a different area in Skyrim. It doesn't even feel like I'm in a different map. And that's something that definitely does bother me. But, let's do this shout. Ben will. Now through him do we see. Good. Who are you? What am I doing here? Well, what's that? Whoa, 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 what's going on? The fuck? Okay. Defeat him. Okay, okay, I can do that. Um, let me bust out my, uh, the shout that I actually give two fucks about. Which is my mark of death. I might as well put that in favorites just because I keep having to switch it on and out. Get him a little bit feeling rough. And see how hard this lurker is. Not too hard whatsoever. Lurker was a little bitch. He has a neck. Leather. That looks like his guts. And this necklace is shark damage. Coo, coo. Kicked his ass. No problem was here. No fucks was given that day. I want to try to drag his body, but we kicked his ass. No, not a single fuck was given. <laughs> Fushra da. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Do do do! I always get friggin' the, the Skyrim song stuck in my head every time we play it. I'll farm. I'm not too far. We'll walk it. If I was a little bit farther, I would just, I would skip it. But we aren't too far. We aren't too far. Ducks can. Oh, never mind. La da 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 da. Is it like up there? I need to get up there. or Am I just seeing shit? All right. Maybe actually, I changed my mind. Since I, I'm kind of stuck at the bottom here, so we'll fast travel. <laughs> so, um, um, this is actually the last episode I'm going to do on the uh, morning it came out, because I want to get some sleep. But uh, we've done five episodes, so I think we're doing a pretty good job. So I guess we're going to jump in here. That's not it. Which one are we going to? This one? Okay. And I guess we'll see what this this girl's gonna have to say about me learning this shout that prevents these people from being controlled. So what's up, man? You have prevailed. I can feel it. Right. Well, your people are free. It's you. You feel it because I'm not dead. So it is. You have proven yourself an ally to the skull, and so the skull shall be allies to you. How can you help me, though? What do we do now? If you have released the Windstone and broken the hold on my people, perhaps you can do the same for the rest of Solstice. That's what I was thinking. I doubt it will fully stop whatever Mirak is doing, but it may slow his progress. Um... I wish I had more options on what to say. Like, all it's like is, that's not enough, I need to stop him now. Like, there needs to be more options. I like to have options in video games. I cannot help with that. None here can. You will need the knowledge Mirak himself learned. You will need to learn more about this black book. Well, I guess my wife just got up to flash me. Like, what the hell are you doing? Get out of my way, vampire. Tell me more about this book, then. Mirak had this? This does not look like something of the dragon cult. It is a dark thing, 
unnatural. I would have nothing to do with it. But the dark elf wizard, Neloth, he came to us some time ago asking about black books. I believe he knows a great deal about them. Perhaps, Perhaps too, much. too much. Seek him out to the south. Be cautious, Dragonborn. There is something else at work here. Oh, dude, there is always something else going. See, now it gives me options to stay stuff, but now I don't really care what the hell May he says. Never touch you. May darkness, the darkness is, the darkness is never touch you. Yeah, I agree. Fushada. No, I'm sorry. I just, I just really can't get certain, certain Skyrim songs on my head. It's pretty awesome. All right, so let's continue on here. Um, I don't know where's I want me to go when I'm down for life, yo. Um, how far do you want me to go? This map looks nice here. It's kind of clear. Well, we'll say like we're in like the snow area, so it's like half, maybe a little bit more than half snow. And then I guess, ooh, it's actually letting me go into a, an area that is, um, not all snow. I like that. There's a little bit of snow, though. That's the thing I'm stressing. I don't want to see so much snow. I'm just so sick and tired of seeing snow in Skyrim. Kind of, I'm just not feeling it. You know, know, know what I mean? And look, the people returned. I saved all of your life. Don't like those eyes you got. There's a bad hunger to them. Dude, it's been many winters. One of your eyes isn't even real, and you're talking about mine? Like, I have a mask on. How can you see my eyes? It's like, that's another thing I don't get. I have this full suit of armor on. The sun can't even touch my skin. But, yet, guess what I get burned by? That's right, the sun. And this dude's like, I can see it in your eyes. You're a demon. I'm like, uh, I have a mask on, you can't see my eyes. And I'm like, son, why you still burn me? Because I have a full suit of armor on that protects every inch of my skin from being burnt by the sunlight? How can you possibly burn me? With a question mark at the end of everything I say? <laughs> so we're going to hike up here, and to be honest, I'm probably not going to uh, get all the way there in this video. I can tell you, we're just going to ramble some and uh, hike up these mountains and hopefully get out this snow crap because I'm not I'm not feeling the snow it's like it hurts my eyes it takes away from the beautiful look of, of uh, Marwin here and I I just keep getting these big old lag spikes kind of upset me because I don't like lag in my game don't lack the lag we're not using fraps here come on burning wolves for no reason other two be a douchebag <laughs> I did the wrong shout, pull the magic out, then equipped the new perk. Forgot its name. Rah! Um, is it the drain? No. There, that one, right? No, that was another new one. Hmm, there it is, Ben Will. We're going to put that as our favorites because... It just keeps becoming something that I have to switch back and forth with, so. Might as well do a nice little quick save before I do the bend the wheel. We all know, no, those damn lurchers are going to come out. Yeah, Will. I'll teach him just fine. Oh, he's up there. How the hell did he get up there? <laughs> I have no clue I got up here, but I know how to get back down there. Me knocking the hell out of him. I've gotta say, I think these guys are a bit too easy. They might be, they might not be. I don't know. I think they're a bit too easy. But 
at least we're heading back in where the mountain is. Like, between the mountain area and the snow area, they have these dark places here. Now, I'm not the uh, brightest, I'm not the sharpest knife in the drawer, as someone would say, but this is definitely load times. This is definitely the game trying desperately to load. And look, a dragon. Why is there a dragon over there? I mean, I don't mind. Let's fight a dragon, but, like, oh, seriously, like, the, the lag in this game is absolutely ridiculous. But nothing like a dragon fight to end this video, so let's do this. Especially, it's like a little bitch frost one, too. So it's giving me, like, full hits, and I'm just, like, laughing at him. Like, what? Are you trying to hurt me, dragon? You're a frost dragon. You're like one of the foolish kind ever. Hey, dragon. I used to be an adventurer like you. Until I took an arrow to the grill. Hey, you want to play like that? You know, I was just going to have fun of you and, and, like, just mess with you a little bit. But if you want to take it, if you want to take it personally. Oh, he would fly back up there, little punk. He knows I was about to take control. You know, let me actually try that new shout on him. Where does his ass go? I was, about, I was like, did he really just bail on me? Stop it, don't kill him, I'm trying to do something. Oh, guess not. I guess that shout's not quite the shout that'll actually give me control of a dragon. Like, again, I don't want the dragon bones. I have tons of money. There's no point in selling them. I'm actually going to get this one. Is this a shot I'm actually going to get? Or is the dude going to show up and steal it? Oh, yeah. That's right. There's a reason they call me the Fushra Da Dragonborn. Because I'm the Shiznix. <laughs> that means I'm amazing. Let's get indoors. Or... I know. You don't, you don't like being in the... In the in here. Um cave. Anyways. Yes. Why well, don't I have any gloves? I thought I had like some cool gloves. Why'd you take those off? Don't take those off. So you guys, we're gonna keep on heading in our direction to get to this place it's actually still kind of far away so uh you know in the next episode we'll do some journeys and we'll we'll get there eventually thank you guys so much for watching you know if you guys are new here uh welcome uh, i am a duck opinion i hope you guys are enjoying this and I hope you guys can stick around and even become a duckling and subscribe because if you like my commentary we have a lot more cool commentary or a lot more gameplay a lot more of just different variety of games for you to enjoy so you know, subscribe, hit us up, check us out, and um, there's a fucking bear. But bears aren't exactly a problem. So, thank you guys for checking it out. Give us a like, leave in the comments what you think, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Peace.